Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here and you like this content, hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, and don't forget to leave a comment. In today's video, I know it's been quite a hot minute. The last video I filmed was my September empties last year. I have a whole slew of empties uh, from October to December. I do have January set aside uh, because I do plan on filming at the end of this month, a little in a few more days actually. Can't believe it's already over halfway through January. But I do have quite a few empties in Scentsy, Body, Laundry, uh, lots of wax bars. The only reason is some months I kind of slack. I try to change my wax every Wednesday and every Sunday, but sometimes with work and my schedule, I don't get a chance. And I used to go through 10 to 14 bars a month. I think I have a little over of that in the course of three months. I've been slacking, but nonetheless, I do have plenty to share, quite a bit. So let's get started. I'm probably not gonna go through the descriptions, but if you have any questions on any of them, want sent notes, want to see if, I will let you know if they're still available, if they're in my club, if I liked them or not. But send notes, I'm not going to open any because there's quite a few. Um, But yeah, the first thing within the last few months that I went through that's empty is uh, a body wash in Vanilla Waves. This one was new and uh, I enjoyed it. I think we got it in a whiff box, I want to say. Um, would I get it again? Yeah, it was a nice vanilla scent. Um, if I got it, if it was in a flash sale, if I did a body love bundle, I would grab it again. It's a very beautiful scent. Um, so that was the only body wash that I went through. I actually, uh, a light bulb went out. Um, oh, I'm going to be random. It's going to go all over the place. I will save the wax for last though. I uh, did use up a 25 watt bulb. This was from October. So this was in the original box. So um, I actually forgot I used the light bulb. So I opened that box up and I was like, holy smokes, there's a whole bunch more wax. But yes, one 25 watt light bulb. You can order these in three packs. <coughs> Pardon me, tickle my, I have a tickle in my throat. Um but three packs um as far as i know you can get them in single but i know color bulbs you buy them individual and there is a three pack of 25 watt bulbs i don't know the price offhand it's been a while i want to say it's like five dollars but since is always changing the prices with the um economy and stuff um i went through a couple hand soaps the first one that i went through around fall time was bright Center life um another one that i went through probably after that, probably into uh, November, December, uh, was Pink Cotton. Um, I usually, if there's a little bit left, I'll put it in one of my foaming hand soaps and make the rest, like have it sit over it. So these are completely cleared out and I make sure to get every last drop because I love the scents of Scentsy hand soap. Um, I went through a tub of washer whiffs in the scent Go Go Mango. This is not available, um, but I would repurchase if it came across the clearance or a sale. I did enjoy this scent. I wish I got more, actually, to be honest with you. All right, so next up, I have some scent packs. I ended up switching out buddies. A lot of them were, if you don't know what a scent pack is, it goes in a buddy. It can also use, be used for dressers, uh, closets, anywhere you want. There are little beads in the back of a scent pack. Uh, they get stuck in the back in the zipper of a, a buddy, and they sent the buddy to um, be whatever scent you want. Um, so I ended up switching out a bunch. A couple were getting to where they didn't smell anymore. Uh, so I have um, five scent packs. The first one is Caramel Apple Craze. This one I would reorder with a buddy, even individually. Um, like I said, they have multiple uses. Um, I also went through a hug and a mug. Um, both of these, I don't know, fall, winter catalogs are, yeah. You can tell I've been on 
off of Scentsy for a while. I still get my monthly club in, but since we're going into spring summer soon but uh this was the other one and amazon rain uh, a nice nice scent all these i would repurchase i didn't have a disappointing um scent pack of course uh coconut lemongrass this one is perfect around uh like odors uh even the wax bar is very good for like say you cook fish and stuff it's a nice little refresh um same with the scent pack i usually stick this one in near the cat's litter boxes and it helps clear up the scent it works well i would reorder it uh for that purpose the only licensed one i had i think i took this out of a winnie the pooh was the um 100 acre wood scent which is like a nice lavender calming scent like I said, I got that through a buddy, so I would reorder if I needed to to top off. I know that that scent isn't available anymore in the wax. Um, I think the only thing that's available Winnie the Pooh wise is the um, like the uh, plug-in uh, pod, uh, and also um, the pods. So, speaking of pods, I did go through a couple. I know I've been lucky with them lasting quite a while. So, over the course of three months, I'm only down to using one of the fans. So, in my kids' room, because that's the only room without a warmer. Um, because it's no mess. You don't have to worry about bump spills. Um, it's And it still sends a, a room. Right now, she has like mold cider and spice and it smells amazingly like a nice spice orange but i went through a my hero which i love the scent this is actually a wax bar that did not come back and it but i did stick it in my quarterly club the other one is the disney princess awaits uh this one i think i used in my daughter's room before i placed it with mall cider and spice and this is the favorite also it's a nice berry scent um okay now that all that's left um is wax i have sample cups i don't know exactly which where i which with box they came in but um some i've actually had for a while um the first one was warm drizzle uh warm pumpkin drizzle this one was nice um i actually think i no this may have been a, yeah these are usually scents of the month so this one was a scent of the month last year um, I want to say, probably going to butcher it, I'm trying to look, um, maybe October's, considering I filmed September's, um, empties, so it was potentially October's, scent of the month, um, but this one was nice, I don't think I stuck it in my club, I should look on that, it's probably gone by now, but I would reorder if I saw it in a future sale or in a clearance, of course, um, Another one that I wanted to try uh, was Sweet Orange and Evergreen. This one was nice, nice tree scent. I'm not big on tree scents, but it did um, serve its purpose. I think it was around like November, December that I used that. Um, I do have three. The only reason I stuck them in here was that some of them, if you see the residue on that one, it's been a while and you'll know why. This one was Black Forest Pine, so this one was from last year. Icicles and Evergreen, this did come back with um, the Holiday Bricks, I want to say. And Cinnamon Pine Cones, this was December scent of the month. It was nice, nice cinnamon scent. Um, both of the trees and cinnamon, out of all those, the one that I would probably want again would probably be the Warm Pumpkin Drizzle. I'm more of a pumpkin than I am a cinnamon and tree scent person okay so lastly um well before i get into the wax bars those were the sample cups they do come in a whiff box if you don't know what a whiff box is it is a um box monthly subscription box that you can get for the u.s price of 30 dollars if you start a scentsy club and spend uh sixty dollars you get ten percent on each individual item which if you is usually about like 10 wax bars mix and match stuff you can do any you can do light bulbs you can do uh laundry care um once you hit that sixty dollar mark you can get a half price item 
You can use any of like uh, tub washer whiffs. You can half brace one of those. My monthly subscription, I end up doing the whiff box. So that's where all those sample cups came from. But like I said, you get a half price. US pricing, because I do live in the United States, is $15. So I enjoy getting the whiff box each month. Like I said, I just didn't know which ones were from what. Um, another thing that I did empty was a fragrance flower. It's in my kitchen right now. It is a, uh, in the scent, uh, it was a summer um, coconut. Maybe I'll throw it in this coming month's empties because it does still smell. We'll go into that description there. I thought I could add it, but I can't think of the, the scent. I apologize. Okay, now on to the wax bars. In no specific order. I do have license in a pile, though. But I'll let you know if they're in my club, if they're a one and done, if they are club potentials, if they're still available, so on and so forth. So let's get started. The first one up is the wizard wizardly world of harry potter wizarding world <laughs> um and this one i enjoyed out of that whole briefcase of those four cents from each house this one came out with the train um the hogwarts train this one was amazing. This one ended up getting st stuck into my quarterly club. So I get it every three months. Um, So I'll get another one next month. My February club. Uh, I get monthly and quarterly in February. But um, this one <laughs> is very nice. I This one along with another one I have in here. Is definitely top five license bars that I've had smell since becoming a sensei consultant so uh next is alice in wonderland we're all mad here i bought two bars out of us with a six bar bundle i melted one i still have a whole bar left i did not stick it in my club i thought it was an okay scent it's no longer available unfortunately um, I will just cherish that one bar I have. If it comes back, would I rebuy it? Yes. But was it club worthy for me with the slew of bars that I have in my clubs? No. <laughs> um, then the next ones are in my monthly club. I get these on a monthly basis. I can let you know which one I would keep, but the other half fights with me and says that he likes the other one better is Angel 624 and Stitch 626. This one's my favorite. This one's his favorite. This is the most club bar um, as a fun fact. It probably will come back. Stitch occasionally does come back. They may come out, out with new products and bring the wax bars back. Um, what I did notice is with the flash sale that happened, if I never saw a sold out by them, but both buddies, Angel and Stitch, were in the uh, flash sale. And then I went and scrolled through. I don't know if I missed the out of stock. And I know they clear up some of the out of stocks before they um, stop the whole flash sale. But they disappeared. If any of you noticed that, leave a comment. Do you know what happened? Did it sell out? I was at work. at. The, I had to go into work after I ordered. So I got to randomly see it during a break. And I noticed that they weren't there. So maybe they kind of made a mistake and we're like we're gonna bring stitch and angel back they could still bring something back from the flash sale just because it's on sale doesn't mean it's gone for good they just could have an overstock in the warehouse but these bars were not in the flash sale just the uh buddies with the scent packs were and i think the stitch warmer was and so on but these are both in my month club they're going to be staying i want to build up a collection they did impress me angel would be in my top five but stitch if it wasn't for the other half i probably would be a couple more bars and good another one that came probably around october november in a whip box was jack's obsession I think I put this in the other half's room. He does enjoy this scent. I actually like to roll the dice better. I know there was a lot of hit or miss with that scent. But this one's like a nice spiced apple. Um, so he enjoyed that one. 
Another one that made it into my monthly club that I kind of missed out on when it was available and I quickly put it in my club before it discont or they put it back in the quote unquote vault was Slinks. Scooby Doo, uh, for a little while it was out of stock. They brought it back. I stuck it in my club. If it is out of stock, you can still go into the Sensi Club and add it to your club and they will make the bar for you. Um, so this one I ended up getting as far as I know, this one was long lasting. It's been a while since I've warmed it. I should warm it again. I do get it on a monthly basis. I did stick this in my monthly club. It was a nice blue raspberry scent, a nice blue wax. Uh, this one was fairly new. There was no residue, but it is a blue wax. It's nice. Um, I'll keep it for a little while. Um, and it, it was enjoyable even for the last minute quickly add to my club just so I could smell it because I didn't get anything from the Scooby-Doo collection but yeah so a couple more that are part of my quarterly club and one I've already mentioned in a pod was mold cider and spice and joy and wonder look at that look at that I had to melt this one it was getting nice and juicy this one's nice long lasting one of my favorite spiced orange scents uh, these were from the holiday collection last year, last, last year, not this past year. It's January. It's not last year. Um, and also joy and wonder. This one's my favorite. It makes for a perfect open concept and even a bedroom scent. I love this one. So both of those were, um, are in my quarterly club. Um, another one that made it to my club that might have to stay in my quarterly club because it is a it was part of the summer collection and I just randomly melted it because I wanted to smell it um was feeling punchy um so this one I wanted to compare it to paradise punch uh I will keep this in my quarterly club because if paradise punch comes back I could take that one out and keep this one and do that comparison I haven't gotten a chance yet but I did lock it into my club Hopefully this does come back. Sometimes scents from collections do make it back to catalog. So that's what happened with Toasted Acorn and Oak. That would have stuck in my club if it didn't come back. But since fall winter is leaving, I might have to stick that back in my quarterly club. Um, Another one that was a scent of the month. This one might actually have been October or September scent of the month was Gimme Candy. A uh, nice candy corn scent. I had this in a room spray. Uh, I have to see if it's available. If anyone knows if this is still available. Um, it's not that I haven't looked at wax. I think I scrolled through and I didn't see it. I know sense of the month only lasts a certain amount of time. Like I said, I have it in a room spray, which serves its purpose. It lasts quite a while. You'll never see a room spray in my empties. It takes forever to go through them. Wouldn't recommend getting it if you want to try out a scent. I would suggest a scent circle. But if you enjoy a scent and you forget to put the wax in your club, I would suggest a room spray. Because <laughs> they last forever. Um, another one that's in my monthly club that was part of a bring back my bar is uh, Blackberry Orange Marmalade. This one I enjoy. It actually took the place of Huckleberry and Clementine. It still is just as good. Um, it makes me keep my stock of Huckleberry and Clementine while more of these come in. Will it stay in my club? Um, I have to see. I have some of the Bring Back My Bar from this month. Um, uh, uh, the 25 bars that came out, um, in, that I locked in my monthly club that I have to try. But for right now, it still is in my monthly club. I do want to build up at least four to six bars before I kick it because um, it takes me a while to go through as many as I have, especially with not changing my wax twice a week. Um, another one that's part of my quarterly club that was part of the Mother's Day collection last year is uh, Sparkling Magnolia. I'm usually not one for these scents, but this one was perfect in the bedroom, is powerful enough to put in an open concept. Um, I found it very, uh, a very pleasant scent. Uh, so that one is in my quarterly. It did, I'll, we'll have to see what comes back this coming Mother's Day. Um, so for then, for now, it's in my club. And I might as well skip to these because along with Mother's Day came Father's Day. I ended up sticking or going through 
two business casuals. This one is my favorite. Um, and it's a nice cologne, men's fragrance, fresh, fresh fragrance, along with my other half's favorite, my dear Watson. These are in my monthly club. I get them on a monthly basis. I try to go through them. We're building up quite a stock. <laughs> um, and now we have two more piles. Let's see. Oh, I just tumbled that one over. Um, uh, this one leaks, so I used it up. It's a bring back my bar. If you can see it, it's cutie pie cupcake. This is still currently in my monthly club. I do enjoy this one more than, um, Clem Clementine cupcake. That's it. It came back for this past, uh, fall winter. It was a spring summer scent came back and continued to be in the catalog for fall winter this was a bring back my bar this leaked probably because it was old as that's the old bring back my bar logo it's but now i can toss this finally but i do get this monthly i do enjoy it i gotta keep it in my club like i said i have a whole slew that i gotta make some decisions before the new catalog comes out and so on and so forth in both of my clubs um, let's see. Some new scents that were in this catalog that are going to be leaving next month <coughs> are Cran Apple Crumble. This one, um, it was okay. I'm a big cranberry person. Um, it might do well aside of like in alternating warmers with oats and honey. I do have Crumb Top co coming in my monthly club next month. Um, so maybe I might mix that. I'm going to try to compare oats and honey with crumb top to see which one I want to keep in my club. There's also another one that sounds just like simply vanilla that I ended up putting in my club because I want to compare both of them and see which one I like better. And another one, uh, let me see, is, um, frosted vanilla. This one was one of the 10 new scents, if I uh, believe so. It was okay. It's a nice little vanilla scent. Like I said, I have Simply Vanilla. I don't think that either Cran Apple Cr Crumble or this one is going in my club. Um, but it was good to try it. Um, if it came back in a sale and it was as cheap as some of these bars were in the flash sale, then maybe I'd purchase a couple more. But, like I said, I got a big club. <laughs> Um, another one was black currant and plum for a new bar. This was, I must have had this one for a little while because it has a little bit of residue. Like this one doesn't, but like, yeah, all you see is a reflection. And another one that actually impressed me and might make it to my club is a velvet moon. This one is kind of like a musky, uh, fragrancy, like perfume scent. Um, I wish I had the scent notes. I don't have my catalog on me, unfortunately. Uh, Blackberry Spice. This one was an open concept. Lasted quite a while. Um, wasn't... I like the tartness of Blackberry, so the spice was... Hmm, uh, wouldn't be club worthy for me, but would I try it again if I ordered... Like, if it was the last one I needed in a six-pack? Maybe. But definitely not, like, top pick. Um, this one, when it went around Christmas time, um, was very snowy spruce. I think this came in a, um, a whiff box. I decided to use it because it was, um, around December, Christmas. I like to make the house smell like a tree because I use a fake tree. So it's nice to get that little holiday feel. Okay, now we're down to the last six bars. Another one that I ended up not putting in my club, I had it in for a little while and I had a half bar left, was Cotton Candy Cookie. This one I do have, I want to say two or four, I think two bars set aside and that's enough. I have Angel to go through. All those like sweet pink haze, I have some. They're all just around the same type. This one, you... If you leave a room and you come back, it does smell like cotton candy, but I had to make some cuts. If it comes back, would I order more in a sale or if it comes back and I bring back my bar again? Sometimes they do repeat themselves. Would I get it? Yes. Um, or try it again if I run out. Um, another couple that I used 
Uh, this one didn't make my club. It is no longer available. It was part of the fall collection. I know I'm delayed. I apologize. This one was part of the three pack. It was Cozy Vanilla and Pumpkin. This one did not impress me. I actually like that sample cup of the Warm Pumpkin Drizzle better than this one. So, um, it was a nice creamy pumpkin. I think I had this in my open concept because the smell on cold was very, like, bold. But it kind of didn't do that when it was warm. It was kind of like a nice mellow scent. Kind of only lasted like a day and a half. Maybe it was just my warmers. But my favorite out of that whole three pack that is in my monthly club, and I like to at least warm one each month, so I was happy to get it once a month, is Maple Rum Cake. I hope this one comes back. Until then, it will be staying in my monthly club. Um, this one is open cosmic worthy. Let this sit, let this um, warm up for a little while. It smells just like a spice cake with cream cheese frosting. A beautiful scent. I love this scent. The other half loves it. It was definitely an amazing scent. Another one that is in my monthly club along with the desserts is Cherry Almond Pie. This was from a Bring Back My Bar. Hint the sticker right there. Um, and it's almond. I think this was Orville's favorite dessert in the description. Um, this one is open concept worthy. Like banana nut bread, this is about a day warm. Uh, maybe a day and a half and then it, you don't smell it anymore. But when it, it starts you can smell it. Like if you leave your house and you come back, it smells like you baked a dessert. I love that. That's why it stays in my club. Okay, lastly, I have a mix and I also save my favorite bar, the best for last. Um, uh, This one is in my monthly club. It is the one that I spoke about comparing with Chrome Top and that is Oats and Honey. It's a nice buttery scent, perfect for berry bars. You can mix I usually do alternating warmers because this with a light scent I tried this with like apple cherry strudel when that was when that was out it overpowered it so now I do this in its own separate warmer and the one that I like to do it with the most my favorite license bar ever I cannot say any I wish this would come out in everything it was part of the flash hail so I hope it comes back I did get a couple more, even though I get it monthly. It's so bad. Uh, is Big Hero 6, would you like a hug? Um, this one is my fave. It's just a nice, bold berry. Other half says it smells like cherry Jolly Ranchers. I think it smells like a cranberry, even though I don't think cranberry might be in the, the minor notes. But I think it's like um, marshmallow with strawberry. Um... But it, it's a uh, open concept. It lasts three to four days in between wax changes. Like, it, the scent pack was wonderful. I don't think they go into, like, body washes for, like, um, licensed stuff, unfortunately. It would make a beautiful body wash. The scent of it would be so bold and vibrant. It'd be like an energized uh, type of body wash. Um, but... That is all of my empties for October, November, and December. I do have a start of January, as like I said. I have slacked on a couple wax changes. I am building up a little bit of a pile, so if I do have enough, I might film or I might do these every couple of months. I know it's been a long while, and if you want, leave a comment. Do you Would you rather see a monthly one if I skip on, or do you think... Every so often is fine. Like do it like every two months to build up a nice little stockpile and make it a good video. I do think that long videos don't get watched all the way through. So if you watched it all the way through, you'd be able to let me know if I should do it every few months or every month. And as always, I can leave some links down below. Like right now, um, Scentsy Club is always available. I went into a little bit of a description. If you want more details, along with my link, comment if you want to know more about Scentsy Club. Um, I can also leave the link for the Bring Back My Bar. Unfortunately, I have not started warming them. Um, I had Christmas, birthday in January, been working like crazy. Um, 
so I haven't really had time. I did stick some in my club, some I just didn't want to smell, and some I have in a couple six pack. I ordered it with the flash sale. I'm hoping that it ships before the end of the month so I can decide whether I want to put those in my club or not. I just wanted to get a couple six bar bundles of certain scents. Some automatically went in like coffee scents. But if you have any questions and um, you want to know more about a certain scent, sorry if I didn't go enough detail in the descriptions, I will let you know exactly notes and everything um, on current scents, bring back my bar scents, and so, so on and so forth. Um, and with that being said, I hope everybody has a wonderful Wednesday. And yes, I did change my wax today, everybody. In Scentsy World, it's Wax Wednesday. Um, and I will see you in the next video. Um, but yeah, just leave a comment, say hi. Feels like it's been forever. It feels great being in front of the camera again. But uh, I hope everybody has a wonderful night and I will talk to you soon. Bye, guys.